Hey, I'm Killjoy, and this is an indie horror game called Wake Up. Now, it's a horror puzzle style game, and it's in the perspective of old school games like Resident Evil 1 and things like that. So I expect tank controls. Anyway, it's a video game. We're gonna play it. Oh, okay. So I just sort of start off here in the back alley in the midst of Noah. That is backwards. Okay. <laughs> oh, this is gonna take some getting used to. So S moves me back like that very slowly, as if I just walked in on my parents having sex. And then W moves me forward. Great. Shift to fast forward. Ah, I see. Yeah, so she'll just stand here doing nothing. Oh, this is this is gonna be awkward. Alright. We have a theater. Left, left, right. Great movie, as opposed to right, right, left, which is my personal favorite. Hello? Is anyone here? It's pretty empty for an opening night. I have two pathways, but only two legs. Wait, left, left, right is the thing in the front, so I take it then this is this is my first puzzle? Maybe I should uh, follow it. Yep, this is a puzzle. Smells like one, looks like one, feels like one, probably is one. So that was two lefts and a right. Remember kids, two lefts don't make a right. That was perfect timing. Wake up. Don't mind if I do. I need some coffee first though. Oh, are we... Are we doing the same thing here? Is this like a left, left, right situation? Left, left... Ah, oh, fuck me. <laughs> I went left, left, back. This is incredibly hard to control. I am just walking into walls. This is what it's like to be drunk. Can confirm. I've been drunk at least half a time. I must have fallen asleep at work again. Yeah, I'm sure that's what happened. You just you just fell asleep and you know knocked your head against the wall and fell asleep. Is the phone ringing? How do I answer that? I don't have a mouth. I don't have hair. I don't have anything. Go floor seven. Well, I've gotten by in life by listening to mysterious voices over telephones, so uh, why should today be any different? Is this an elevator? Will it elevate me? Beyond... Beyond belief? I press 7. Good for you. You know numbers? Wow. There's, there's someone breathing in my ears. I don't particularly enjoy that. Except in an ASMR setting, in which case it's okay and only mildly sexual. This door was open, I'm sorry, I just kind of barged right in. I hope you weren't doing anything incriminating. Is that a phone? Can I touch it? Hello? Oh. Hello, pair of legs. You look great today. Oh, it's me. Those were my legs. Nice. I just go back in here? The room is all bloody now. I think that says to, uh, wake up, except it's mirrored. Maybe it's Russian, I don't know. Right. Oh, hey, it's me. I look good today. Oh, okay. All right, I'm going to turn around, and I'm just going to leave. I'm going to waddle my way out of this room. Back to the elevator, all right? You, uh, you have fun. Hold on, hold on. I want to get this good shot here of it coming out of the room. It's going to follow me? Slow motion. Okay. Uh, elevator, press button. Press 11. This, this hotel has 11. I assume this is a hotel. It has 11 floors. It's fancy. God, this is so fucking hard to control. I imagine it'd be easier for a controller. There are buttons under these paintings. There are? What did they say? This painting has a young boy on it. Okay, what about this one? It resembles a tombstone at a newly dug grave. This one resembles a couple getting married. It's a painting of a baby. And the last one. The painting resembles an old man. I'm guessing I'm gonna have to press these in the correct order. It's like time? Time. You don't say, it's a giant fucking hourglass. Anything else in here? Any more clues? Genius? Alright, well, I'm guessing we gotta start off with Baby, right? Baby, the incredible hit wonder by Justin Bieber. A uh, young boy, perhaps? Young man? In the case of modern day society with anti-vax parents, um, I'm pretty sure the next step would be the grave, but uh, we're, we're working on like uh, the classical generation uh, time era. So we have Baby, Boy, and I guess Marriage is the next step, apparently. That's how it works, you know, you get married at the ripe old age of 12, uh, old man, and then I'm guessing death, because why not? Hooray, I did it. I opened the thing. I love it when that happens. I still can't get, <laughs> I can't get over how I just moonwalk back. Okay, 
This is fucking trippy. Oh god. <laughs> that is um that is fucking with my eyeballs. I like it though. Uh, oh, hello. I have to collect keys? I have a bad feeling about this. Oh, okay, so we go down to uh, top-down controls. That's interesting. I'm stuck. I picked up the key. Great. Good for you. You have fingers. So the boxes sort of disappear on me. Do the silver ones? Yep, the silver ones do too. I thought maybe it was just like a, a certain thing. Oh, I've already fucked myself, haven't... I didn't even touch it. I just lightly breathed on it. <laughs> oh no. Okay, I, I have an idea. I'm gonna try going around uh, this this away. Oh no, I screwed myself. Well, uh, time to uh, die. All right, let's try that again. I have an idea in mind. It's it's a great idea. It's the best idea. If these controls would fucking work for me, I have to take this super slow, or else I'm dead again. This time, not of my own free will. Okay, if I can just walk this way. And then diagonal here, and over here, grab that key, angle this perfectly, like a fucking surgeon. Amazing. Okay, now I need to get that key. I fucked myself again, haven't I? Shh, God damn it. Because, <laughs> like, I'll get, I'll get over here. And it's, my plan was to just walk over here then and be like, oh, hey, yeah, I'll just walk on this platform, get the key. And then it's all hunky-dory. Well, guess what? I can't fucking do it now. Uh, I am a genius. Well, time to commit Sudoku again. All right, I need to figure out, like, the perfect, pristine plan to get myself through this. And I have an idea this time. It's foolproof. Third time's the charm. Guarantee you. So we start by picking up this key here. Then we make our way downtown over here, if you know what I mean. We grab ourselves the second key, and then, and then we do a little, a little loop right around here, back over. See? Now we pull a sneaky on him. And now, now we do my original plan, because the original plan was fucking genius. It's just, I, I missed a step. Just, just like with everything. I was thinking too far ahead. You know, I, I just have that much brain power inside my asshole. See? Now I got all the keys needed to unlock one fucking door. The keys worked, you don't say. So I'd say wake up over there as well. Once again, I don't wanna. Oh, this is nice. Where am I? This must be hell. I've been waiting for this day. The fast forwarding really doesn't help that much. It just sort of screws with my perception. Oh God. Yes, the two guardians, one headless and the other dickless. One has a sword, two wears a hat in the sun, three is close to the center, Four stands between two brothers. Two brothers. Five with a sword is near a corner. Six has lost his head. So I need to find the sword, dude. Which is this one, I think. Yeah. You... The statue reacted with a sound. Great. As do I when I am touched. Two wears a hat in the sun. Okay, so... You're in the sun, but you're headless. You have a hat, but you're not in the sun. You're not a cool boy like me. You're not bald. So I'm guessing you're the Mad Hatter, the one in the sun. I'ma touch you. I'm at perfect dick sucking height too. Okay, so what's the other one? Three is close to the center. I mean, this one's close to the center. He's headless. All right, I'm gonna try you. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm guessing that worked. So I've done one, two, and three. Now four stands between two brothers. So I'm just trying to think of like, six is obviously this dude over here, so I don't have to touch him yet. I've already touched you. I've already touched the one at the end, so four must be over here. He stands between two brothers, so I'm guessing he's the gentleman with the nice hat. And then next up would be this dude over here in the corner and the sword. And then the last one is the other headless guy, right around here. Something happened to the force field. Yeah, that's because I used my big old brain and I solved the puzzle. Nice. Oh god! Oh! Hi! It's me, but... On all fours. It's me after a night out. <laughs> Caution, electric fence. Oh boy, better not touch it. So is he just gonna follow me around like a dog? 
It's kind of cute. I have like a ball I could play some fetch with him. He's got a massive gaper. It's not an insult, it's just an observation. Oh god, it's gonna catch me. Oh no. Tank controls are not fun. Oh god, he's right on my ass. He's, he's right in sniffing distance. <laughs> it's gonna get a whiff. Please stop following me, I am uncomfortable. This is a really bad angle. Okay. I have made it to the edge of the universe. What do you say to that? Ha! Huh. I found your weakness. Sunlight. Actually, that's my weakness. But, um... I guess we're one and the same. You and I. Maybe I can go back and pet you. Nope! <laughs> okay, so yeah, it's, it's afraid of the sun. I shall take my leave, then, through the portal. My dreams keep getting stranger and stranger. I don't think this is a dream anymore. This looks like real life. This is actually kind of cool. I like this setup. You got, like, the... Really high resolution images here. Like, that's, that's fantastic, actually. This kind of reminds me of like, um, just, just in a slight way, like Grim Fandango. I don't know why, even, even though that had like, they, they were rendered backgrounds, but they still look somewhat real. Yeah, they, they, they didn't. I'm, I'm just misremembering. Where do, we, oh, okay. Obviously I go over there. I thought I was supposed to climb these giant steps. Evidently not. Is there, is there a way over here? Oh, there was a way over here. Okay. I got lost for a second. It's probably because I don't have any eyes. I am way too tall for this building. Never mind. <laughs> There's a strange computer here. I know what a computer is. Oh, God. Hello. <laughs> Gasp. Technology. My weakness. Oh. It's repeating. Except this time it's all screwed up looking. What happened here? I gotta go back inside? Oh god! Nope. 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 I don't want any of this. I'm going- I'm leaving. I'm going back to my alley. Fuck you. Uh, my alley is not safe. <laughs> Greetings, friends. Are you here to, um, five dollar sucky? Okay. Wake up. Well, um, <laughs> that was a weird game. You know, I, I, I enjoyed it for what it was. It was certainly a, an interesting throwback, especially with the tank controls and the, like, sort of, like, heavy, low-res polygonal design to it. You know, it was, it was quite confusing overall in terms of story. I, I guess, like, we somehow stumbled upon some sort of, like, parallel universe alternate reality or something in our dreams and then we ended up in different areas and shit was repeating and then like we talked to someone on the phone and it was us and then we had to go and like confront us and then there was then there was us walking backwards and us with a ripped open head and it's kind of weird that was fucking strange but i i all i know is i i enjoyed it and i'm left with many questions anyway thanks for joining me for wake up Hope we got some enjoyment out of this video. As always, take care, and I hope to see you around sometime.